Hello, friend. Hello. My name is Ginger. I'm a priest with the Celtic Christian Church. Welcome to Coffee Break Prayer. An unusual Coffee Break Prayer because um, today is June 24th, 2022. The United States Supreme Court has just announced its decision to overturn Roe v. Wade. And I think we can agree that the nation's in tumult over this decision, right? Like some people are full of joy and a sense of victory and other people are full of grief and anger and fear. So as Christians, how do we respond as people who pray to be and hope to be a little Christ's? The literal meaning of the word Christian is a little Christ, right? To be little versions of Jesus walking around as individuals and as community, right? People are watching. How do we live through this moment? Whatever we do, and I hope that the first thing we do is speak gently to one another. 25% of American women have experienced abortion. Let's never, ever be rough with each other, ever. However we feel about that number, let's recognize that we are surrounded by people who need our love, right? And let's always be gentle. In the name of our Creator, Jesus, our Liberator, and the Spirit who is holy. Amen. Abba, I am reaching here for words to express um, my prayer and, and hopefully to, to gather in with, with my prayer, the prayers of others to lift up to in this time of, of what appears to be trauma in our country as we, we um, disagree so sharply with each other. And I'm reaching for words to express to express my own grief, my own concern, my own hope for the country that I love. Help us to represent your son well. Help us to represent Jesus well. Give us gentle hearts. Give us wisdom and peace. Help us to be people of integrity. Rejecting misogyny, rejecting racism in all its forms, welcoming one another. You called us to be um, rulers, to help bless all the creatures and the plants of the earth. And we can't even bless each other. I ask your forgiveness, Abba, for myself, for my nation, for all people, for what we have done, for what we have failed to do. And now we come to you and ask that you mend what is broken and help us to find a way forward. Christians, too, are divided on this question, despite what... Um, despite what like, the popular perception may be. Help us, no matter what we believe, to, um, to represent Jesus well and to love each other. This we ask in Jesus' name. Amen. My friend, thank you for your patience with me as, as I prayed with you today. I felt like, you know, we kind of have to talk about the huge stomping, smashing creature on the table that's yelling and, you know, how do you pretend there's not a hippopotamus rampaging through your living room, right? So we needed we need to pray about this together, but how? I hope that God gives you courage, that God gives you peace. And um And be blessed, dear one, in the name of Abba, our creator, Jesus, our liberator, the spirit who is holy. Amen.